Do you know that you have three to five pounds of bacteria in or on your body? These bacteria make up your microbiome and those bacterial cells are your friends. They do things for you. They break down your food and they make vitamins for you. But you probably know that bacteria can make you sick. For example, staph infections and strep throat are caused by bacteria. Your immune system has to manage all of these bacteria, sorting out the good from the bad. It's fascinating when the system works, but horrific when it doesn't. When a beneficial bacterium is mistakenly identified as a harmful one, the immune system's attack can trigger diseases such as asthma, Crohn's disease, and even cancer. Grimes and her research team, made up of dedicated graduate and undergraduate students, take an interdisciplinary approach that pulls from chemistry, biology, immunology, and microbiology. Her innovative team examines how the body identifies bacteria and why it sometimes mistakes beneficial microbes as invaders. Bacteria coat their cells in a jacket of carbohydrates. Our human cells don't have these jackets, and we can use pieces of that coat to keep track of things. Just as a jacket you wear might shed lint, bacterial coats shed too, sloughing off sugars or carbohydrates. Our bodies use these shedded bits to keep track of their activity. It's your body's first line of defense. My lab has extensive background in carbohydrate chemistry, and we make mimics of these sugar fragments. I'm so fortunate to work with a dynamic team that utilizes skills from organic chemistry, molecular biology, and biochemistry. It is a fantastic time to be a graduate student in Catherine's lab. I work with some of the best molecular biologists and microbiologists, both here at UD and across the country. Together, we have learned that bacteria have a defined program of how it makes its jacket. We've figured out a way to trick bacteria, both good and bad, to install little flashlights into the sugars of the jacket. This is useful both for illuminating the whole jacket, but also the fragments that fall off, which are ultimately sensed by the immune system. Once the jacket fragments are released, your body's innate immune system picks them up, much like a hand picks something up. As a biochemist, I'm extremely interested to learn more about the signaling process that happens when our bodies detect bits of the carb jacket to relay the right message to the body. Learning about these interactions will give us clues to come up with new therapeutic targets to treat a number of diseases, like Crohn's disease. It's our hope that we are making an even bigger impact by sharing our reagents with researchers around the world. I love working with my team, training new students, and motivating students in the classroom. It's my job as a university professor to induce people to think creatively, and I use my research platform to do this. The most rewarding part of my job is anticipating the impactful research that my students will go on to produce. I am so grateful for the University of Delaware and the Camille and Henry Dreyfus Foundation for believing in this mission as much as I do.